Hey everybody, it's me, Leticia, with So Adventurous, and today I am going to try out my Dritz Heavy Dewy Snap Kit. And I was just reading the instructions that you can find on the back of the package on the four pieces that you are going to need to install a Heavy Duty uh, Snaps. So on the anvil, there is a side that's got a little raised center, and then there is a concave side as well and so to start we're going to use the concave side okay so the two items you need are these two items here and on the picture you're going to notice that this particular male piece here has got two like rectangles on the side of it i don't know if i can get that to focus or not yeah there we go but there's two little rectangles on the side and so you're going to need that and then you're going to need this piece here to that's got a hole where the male part is going to go inside. So what you do is you lay down the smooth side to the concave side. Okay. And then you're going to put this on top of that and you're going to grab your post that you're going to be hammering. Now I have a mallet that my husband bought for me and it's this wonderful thing here I don't know why he bought it for me but one day he was thinking about me and saw it and said I'm gonna get it for her so then we're gonna put this where there's a, again another little raised side you're gonna put that down onto the post of that male part and you're going to hammer it so you want those prongs to spread so that it's going to be secure. Sorry if it's loud. See that's kind of loose so I'm going to go ahead and hammer it just a little bit more. Okay. All right. And uh, that looks good. We're going to see how good it is, aren't we? One more little test. All right. So then, after you've done that side, you're going to do the other side. And again, this is uh, looks like a male. It's got a raised post on it. That's going to go down on this other half where it's got the center that's a little bit of raised up. So you're going to turn it over, put that down on there. Then you're going to grab this other piece that is completely raised up. And it's got a hole in it. And you're going to lay that on top of there. Once again, grab my post, we're going to hammer it down. You want to get it good and secured. Okay, let's see how that's looking. I'm going to go ahead and tap it a few more times. Okay. So, okay, so I've done that, and let's just see if these are going to snap together, how well they work. Ooh, they work good. Now, will I be able to get them apart? It's a good question. Probably going to have to pry them apart with something, because <laughs> you normally don't just snap two pieces together like that without being attached to anything. So I wanted to just give you guys a quick look see on how that works and it does snap I can't unpull it apart unfortunately because well I don't want to break my nails because I'm a nail girl but anywho it does work now you're not gonna of course do it like this you're going to actually be attaching it to a project and I'm gonna turn this into a little snap pouch and um, I'm gonna have a tutorial on how to do that and then it's going to be closed with this snap closure, not this particular one. But it's going to have a snap closure. And I wanted to just test out how simple it would be. Um, now, when I get to that part on this, I will be attaching it to the actual project. So stay tuned for that. And I hope that you found that this was helpful. Again, this is the Dritz Heavy Duty Snap Kit that I got. I got it at Joann's. It was like $8.99. I was going to just get the separate snaps um, and the kit and, and the, you know, the actual anvil and post, but 
that was good. This alone was $5 and then the snaps were like $7 and I didn't think that was a really good deal. So I could get the whole thing together, you know, um, for $8.99 and, you know, that way I could test it out. All right then. So if you have questions, let me know. If you have comments, please comment down below. Like and subscribe. Share, share, share. Um, this is again Leticia Helgerson at So Adventurous. Bye-bye.